Hello, today's magical colors. Let's draw flamingo. To draw flamingo, we will be needing one paper, one pencil, few colors, pen or marker, whatever you have. Let's draw flamingo. To draw flamingo, it is very easy to draw. You have to do what? You have to make a curve like a candy cane goes up big and you go curve and make small and then make a big hump like a backwards U. Then connect and then come back. See? You can do it. Easy, right? Now we need to make a neck for our flamingo okay so let's do it from here go back curve and make s oh actually this is s not backwards s but s and then one more s okay then backwards u and then a semicircle to make a beak it is called bill you make a triangle first Put the eyes inside and make a long W and then curve, go down and then straight line and connect. And then make triangle again here and this beak is dark on the end of the beak. And then make one line here. That's it. And you can put some feathers inside. Okay. So let's connect like this. It is folded, right? It's not open. She's not flying. The, our flamingo is not flying right now. Standing, right? And they have long leg. You know, this is their knees. And then go down. And they have very narrow legs, okay? And they have a little bit curve here. Those are ankles, you know that? Yeah, it's not knees over there. There's an ankle over there. Make one line and let make like a V or fork. Okay, let's make one more leg. This time we're going to make it little upwards like we are making four. They often like to stand on one leg. Yes, they do. Let's make a curve for the ankle and then come back make a straight line and make a fork that's it see you can do it now you know let's make one more on the other side now we're going to do backwards s okay so we need big curve backward s like this okay and then go up and make a backwards u now we will do it again for our neck see then come down and connect now let's make some curves inside okay to show their feathers then we're going to make a v inside w outside curve and go back and connect okay we're going to put beautiful eyes here they have beautiful eyes like this and then line inside and then we're going to make again the leg standing and then we will make one more here which is we're going to make it double the line curve curve come down and make a line here and make a fork there you go now we're going to make like a four letter four okay i mean number four This time it looks like a V shape. Okay, that's it. And you know they can fly also. Let's make one more, which is flying up. Okay, they can fly so well. You know that they can fly really up high <laughs> to make a curve, long neck, the body, and then 
comes down and their legs goes all the way straight out okay and they have their legs down their body come back in curve w for the beak this is v this is w and it is looking going that way so it's the beak is here and then you can put the eyes inside here and then we can make what wings let's make wings how to make it like this go curve curve and come and connect okay this is the front one and let's make one more curve up and then curve 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 like we are making loops okay this is the one more there you go so we have our flamingo ready do you know flamingos are almost three to five feet tall they are really really tall and now we are coloring pink some are pink colors and some are orange colors flamingo you know that there are also some off-white creamish and they are white as well Let's do the outline first and then we're going to fill it inside okay so you color you like you can color orange if you want to or you can color pink if you like to their peaks are almost here black yeah. and uh, you know what flamingos give eggs yeah and mama and papa both take care of the eggs and you know they make nest in the mud. Yes, they do. They do make nest in the mud and lay their eggs over there. Yes. And you know how long it takes? It takes almost 30 days. Yeah. To hatch the egg. Mm -hmm. And mama and papa will take care of the egg. So baby comes out and stays in the nest for more than a week like two three weeks i think till they are able to join a group right now we can do orange color to our other flamingo and we will also do an outline Shall we do outline first? Okay, let's do the outline. Make a beak. First, we're going to make S. And then we're going to make backwards U. We're going to make very shallow U. Or you can say semicircle. Okay. And curve back and make again like a letter S and connect okay now make a V shape here W and connect put I here one line go curve and go up straight yes now we're going to make their knees and then we're going to make a leg then curve for the ankle you know they cannot bend their knees it's right here how would they bend they cannot right that's why they have ankle here so they can bend and fold and then they can run so fast also you know and they fly really up high yeah they can do that let's make an outline this side also this is backward s because this is looking this flamingo is looking on the left side and this flamingo is looking on the right side and you can decide which side your flamingo is looking, right? It's a curve like a backward S this is. And this side was S. Now let's make a V inside, close it, make W, curve, go in and connect straight. Sometimes my marker does not work. I have to hold it in a different angle. Do you have a marker? You can do it even with the pencil. Just raise it one more time and it will become a little darker. Yep. And you know what else you can do? You can make a puppet out of it. Cut and make some puppets if you like. 
draw color cut and make a puppet see almost done I want to talk more about flamingo you know flamingo got their name from latin and spanish you know what that means it means fire yeah flamingo name means fire and the color sometimes is orange like a fire right so let's color orange and let's do outline as well now i cannot find my color orange it's okay if i can't find it i can make it little red maybe i can make some light red to show orange okay you can color whatever you color you have it's okay whatever color we have we can use it right yes you can use it whatever color you have so i did half red to show fire and now i found my orange so let's try to do orange on the top of this flamingo which looks like a pink though it's okay you can put whatever color you have learn the drawing how to draw see how nice this color is it's like a neon color i like this color you like it mm, i like it this is almost done see and they eat you know what they eat they eat fish and shrimps and their beaks are called bill they can drain the water from there and keep the food in their mouth. Yeah. They can turn their neck any side they like. Mm -hmm. So if they want to look that side and get the food, they can turn their neck on the other side, bend it, curve it, however they like. They do. Yeah. Everybody has, every animal has their own speciality what is yours do you color and draw very well i think you do you all are so young artists so keep drawing and coloring if you like to let's put some water and we are all done And they live 40 years. Yeah, their, their lives are longer than other birds. And they live in the sandy land. Yep. Okay, take care. Have fun. Bye.